Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. So um, what I have in this case, I have tan of theta equals zero. And what I want to do is show you how to evaluate our six trigonometric functions. Not really. I just want to evaluate one trigonometric function. When is the tan of theta equal to zero? Now remember, the tan of an angle, any angle that's going to intersect on the unit circle, is going to be equal to the value of x over y of that coordinates, now where that angle intersects the unit circle. So we know that we can't have x be our zero. Um, because if x was 0, then uh, we would have an undefined function. So we only need to determine now where is my y coordinate equal to 0. So therefore, what I'm going to do is I need to go ahead and look at my unit circle and determine, well, when is the y coordinate equal to 0 between our constraint of 0 and 2 pi? Well, there's only two points where the y coordinate is equal to 0. Because these two points, this is 0, 1, and that's 0, 1. So when looking at our two points on where our unit circle is going to be equal to 0, you can see that the only angle that it's equal to 0 is at this angle, which is pi. It can't be 0 and 2 pi because those are, a part, those are uh, not a part into our constraints. They're not, uh, they're not included. So therefore, the only angle where theta, where y coordinate is going to equal 0, so therefore our tangent of our theta of angle would equal 0, is going to be at the angle pi. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you evaluate your six trigonometric or just your one trigonometric function for theta. Thanks.